What's up, everybody? My name is Lehua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host a podcast across worlds, and I stream on twitch.tv slash Lehua Superfina. Today, we are reacting to The Faraway Paladin. And if you like anime reactions, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next upload. And if you like to support the channel, we got channel membership, Patreon, and merchandise. Link to those are below. We are reacting to The Faraway Paladin episode Eight. last episode was 7.5 it was like a recap of what's going on so far which is like a really good review because brah a lot of stuff is supposed to happen after this mm -hmm. a lot like we saw his past bonds and we're supposed to see new bonds mm -hmm. we saw those openings right he gets comrades and we got the first one menno mm-hmm and this one, from what I see on the thumbnail, we're going to see the others. Yes! Let's watch the episode. Oh, no livestock. Not much tools. White sails. White sails is such a good name. Like, really gives away that it's at like a harbor. Where there's trade and such. Yes, a review of the area. Hunter here took out the king of the demons. Look, us, Mary, and. There's blood, there's his red hair. Yo, they really only show blood's shoulder <laughs> and like half of his head. Oh, her following declined. You think that was done on purpose because Grace feels divine blessing repelled the undead, which is part of the horde? Huh. You know what I mean? Where, like, take out the weakness. Wow, they actually looted the ruins. <laughs> yeah. A giant ape. Look, 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 look. It's the halfling. She was in the thumbnail. Our new companions are here. Oh, she feisty for a little one. Great ape. Do not break eye contact. Show that you're not afraid. You will whoop his ass. Look, he walked away. He's like, whew, I didn't have to fight it. <laughs> Look at her eyes sparkling. I go where the wind takes me.
Holy noble sounding name. <laughs> Warrior priest. Mm-hmm, that's what he is. Pretty spacey, but he's stupidly strong. <laughs> this is why this place is called Beast Woods. <laughs> Oh, your escorts ran away. So shame. They just look scary. I feel like the subtitles could have been better. I'll do the deal making, not you. Here's the deal making. Work it, Menno. Work it. <laughs> She's like, sheltered equals noble. <laughs> Can't talk about your family. <laughs> oh, true bard at heart. Reading into the situation. Yep. Exaggerating it. <laughs> she knows how to tell a story. She knows how to think of a story. Has no concept of distance to people. <laughs> I love how energetic she is. She's like super hyper. I like it. It like totally breaks the ice. <laughs> She goes wild, yep, yep, she's wild. You have a proposal? Bring them in with the healing and pass them off for the selling. <laughs> Blessing is a rewrite of reality through the power of a god. Not mistake it for my own power. Yeah, no, you're training sun. <laughs> I wonder if Menno is 
voicing out all of Ponyo's uh, selling skills, strategies, as a way to point out, like, Ponyo is a lot smarter than comes off as. Three heroes! The killing of the... Yes, 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 yes! Yes, sing about that, yes! Well, it's like super excited. He's like, yeah, tell me about my family! Oh, she does like a little opening, a narration. The Wyvern Killer. Be quiet now and listen. Demon Blade. Kept his true name concealed to the world. Though time has passed, he name is yet unknown. No one knows Augustus real name. Beautiful as a princess from a faraway land. When asked about her lineage, the healer would gently smile. Yeah, she does give off an, an impression of noble lineage. So I didn't read that far in the story. But I'm wondering if later on in the story, Will encounters Mary's family. Even though 200 years pass, right? But still. Here's the wyvern. Beautiful half elf was chosen as a sacrifice to appease it. Blood asked where they could get the money. Isn't that Gus thing? Money is usually what like Gus. Where would they get the money? Oh, where would they get the money to pay them? Since it's, I guess, a poor village? Look, it's Mary! <laughs> there you go. There's Gus taking the money. What fine money. Look how it shines. Such pushovers, there's no profit in this. <laughs> oh, sell him to a slave trader. You really want to save this girl? Blood likes that. You're small, but you're a warrior who swallows his pride to ask for help. Ah, uh, so. Blood was a judge of character before he goes into action. Okay, okay. Very interesting how they still show us the English subtitles, Japanese subtitles of this magic incantation in another language. I like that. The dedication it reminds me of Mushoku Tensei.
But I really do like seeing this uh, storytelling slash flashback of just Mary and Blood. These two look so young. Are they like Will's age? Like 14? Around that age? <laughs> He's like, this is more than I paid you. What? What is this? He's like, are we getting scammed? Investment lending. If your name someday reach our ears, we'll come to collect what we, what we lend to you plus interest. I will give you my real name in preparation. This will be our password. Will knows his real name. Count Dagger. Actual surname was Wuz Dagger. Wuz Dagger. What? And the half elf is still there. She's waiting for someone to visit her with Gus's real name. Will, you gotta visit that half elf. You gotta go visit her. I hope you visit her in this season. Please. That'd be great. You bet he was moved by your store, B. Yeah, it's really good. That Will knows that people still remember the three because they sacrificed so much. Is that tea he's holding? You can see how polished his movements are? What is it that Will wants? Doesn't Will want friends? Oh, he's more like a holy knight. What is it that you as an individual wish for? Or are you strictly a representative of the goddess? He had a happy life, and now after he lost that happy life, he got the divine blessing. Oh, he admits he doesn't know what he wants, but he thinks he'll be able to find it. Look, friends, companions, yes. Friendship, the power of friendship. <laughs> oh, 
calling him priest like he's putting him up on a pedestal. <laughs> Third position. I know Robina would be angry if I tried to get ahead of them. <laughs> you guys have not traveled together that long and you already want to be that close with Will? Look at this. Will has all this charisma. Mm -hmm. They want to be his friend. Will enough to get in line. Freeze <laughs> and bread appears. Oh, are we getting the status of white sails? New ruler has taken over. Okay. Oh, but there's a bit of a problem. Oh, no. Prince Owen falls short to his father. King's brother, who was dispatched to White Sills, is a great wise man. Crown Prince, Ethelbold, Rex. Are we gonna call him Rex for short? <laughs> I doubt it. But for sure, we're gonna encounter him. We're gonna. Will is probably going to be friends with him. He's in the opening. This one symbol of what Blood Mary and Gus gave their lives to protect. Another great episode. No keys seeing a bit of Gus, Mary's, and Blood's life as adventurers, as part of the 100 Heroes. Oh, that was really good. I really like that. And we got new companions. Mm -hmm. More people to bond with Will for him to protect. Yes. But what did you think about this episode? And what did you think about this video? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to talk outside of YouTube, there's a Discord. Link is in the description. Outside. Oh, wait, not outside. Uh, and I stream on twitch.tv slash superfina outside of youtube and twitch i host podcasts across worlds where we talk about anime manga and other things we're interested in if you like podcasts like that link to the podcast is in the description we're available on all platforms other than that my name is lehua and this is superfina channel reacting to the faraway paladin episode 8 hope you guys like this video and i'll see you on the next one laters